is up gamers it's geo here and yes i know i caved i caved in and got the switch after seeing um nintendo at e3 i mean I, they pretty much won e3 for me um they came out swinging and rightfully so they have to after that disaster wii u console and once i seen the gameplay that mario odyssey i had i had to pick one up i seen one in the store today and it's selling out like hotcakes and i just think they're going to be continuing they're going to continue to sell out at this rate all the way to the holidays. It's probably going to get worse at the holidays. So um, I picked this up, and I got a couple accessories. Um, obviously, I got these two right here. Um, I mean, the best game on the system. You got to have that. And then Mario Kart, I never even got a chance. I never even opened it on my Wii U. So that goes to show you, and you can't have a Switch without a um, – a screen protector, even though there's a better one I got on Amazon, I'll leave a link in the description. Um, but just but just for right now, I'm, I'm not gonna have it raw, not raw at all. And I got a free case that came with it, yeah, yeah. So you know, a little cheap off brand. I don't know, I know they make TVs, but free case, free 95 is my type of price. So, um, let's get to this bad boy. All right, so you got the I think this is the back. Let go the front. I went on ahead and got the uh, the red and blue. Probably gonna make it all red. Um, nothing on the side over here. Uh, nothing really on this side. Maybe on the back. Uh, no, just showing accessories and stuff. So uh, let's go ahead and get into this. It's kind of weird from the, the angle I'm doing it at. <laughs> Help look at this uh, tab out right here, huh? huh? Uh, there we go. Oh, gotta open it this way. In the front, of course. Oh, check her out. I don't want to hit the mic. You guys hear something loud? Ugh. Check it out. Ooh, oh, that's a cool color. I like I like that red. That's a cool color red. All right, let's let's take this stuff out. We'll, we'll get we'll get back to the bread and butter after we see what's in here. Oh, oops, set this down right here. You guys are probably gonna see it on the side. All right. Um, HDMI cable. Wow, that adapter is a little bigger than what I thought. I will say that. I didn't think the adapter was going to be this big. So you probably can't charge it with just a regular um, USB port from what I was thinking. Because I was going to be slick and use a USB. But obviously this thing consumes way too much power. But shout out to, you know, Nintendo using, you know, US uh, Type-C, US, yeah, US Type-C um, cords because... The old USBs become a thing in the past, and I didn't use proprietary because that shit was garbage. Um, it's like a clip, clip for the controllers. I hope it came with two. If it only came with one, that's a fucking rip. Cause that means I'm gonna have to go back to the store and buy another one. No, it's over here. Okay, there it is. Couldn't see it. Lucky I had my handy dandy camera. Yeah, so uh, two little triggers that go on the uh controllers. I, you know, I, I thought it would feel a little more, uh, so where I guess sturdy. Put that over here. All right. And we got the little controller dock for the uh, for these controllers right here. I can tell it's going to feel weird. So I, I see what some of the reviewers and stuff are saying. Because it feels a little weird in my hand right here. So I can only imagine. Once those get in, I just wish they would include the, the chargeable one. That would have been cool, but, you know, the hell with it. And this piece, from what I heard, is not that um, well made, but we'll see. Get, the, get this out and get the damn box out the way. That everything. Okay, make sure I got everything out the box. Oh. Goodbye, box. You served your purpose in life. I might keep that box just to just to keep it. All right, so this dock. 
There goes the doc. Uh, you know, <laughs> when I seen the price for this today, you know, I looked and I was like, they want $80 for this loan. $80, which makes me question, why did you just sell this separate in the doc? separate, you know, for people who want to play on the TV. Because probably, I'm probably going to rarely play this on TV. Um, most of the time, it's 720, upscales to 1080. Uh, for me, you know, 1080 would have been cool, but you, you scaling games to 720 in uh, 2017, that's a big no-no. Yes, but this thing, I've seen a standalone for 80 bucks. I don't know how the hell this is $80. And that, that, that I can't believe how much of a cost. I'll just say that. I can't believe how much this damn thing costs. And it scratches up the screen, so, I don't know what Nintendo was thinking with that, but all right, <laughs> all right, make sure I got this the right way, I think I got, you know, I, I don't even think it even matters, but, um, <laughs> take out these Joy-Cons, yeah, that would only make the system, what, like 120 bucks, I think, I really, I really like that read, I do, I was gonna get the gray one, but I seen this was the last color one, and I, I'm, I'm just a, I love being uh, the last person to get something. I don't know why. I will say these do feel pretty cool. Like they don't feel, it got, it got a nice little weight to it, and I thought it was gonna feel. They looked a little cheap, but they're not. Now this is where stuff is gonna feel weird when I'm gaming. I'm used to having two. You know, thumbs, you know, kind of right here next to each other. And you're going to be gaming like this. It's going to feel kind of awkward. Yeah, I'm going to have to get used to that. But I don't know. On the Wii, on the Wii U, when I had it up here, I was complaining about the buttons being down here. So, I don't know. All right. How about, let's get the uh, main attraction here. Oh, you sexy thing. You. Hey, guys. So, the reason, real reason why I really got this, the Smock Z is taking too long. And then they got some good exclusives coming out. So I can wait along, especially when I seen Rocket League 2. That that was really the deal sealer right there. Let's see. Mm, hey camera. All right. So this is a, a beauty, I will say that. Now, this part feels real good. I mean, it doesn't feel cheap at all. Not even a little bit. Let's see. Got a kickstand right there. Huh. I think I think it could break off, too. No, I'm not even going to mess with it. because I, I have seen it break off, though, because I know Nikon's selling a metal, a metal piece for that, and I think I'm going to get it. With the charge, volume, power button, vent to cool this motherfucker down, headphone jack, put your game in here. Now, this is my thing. It feels like over time, you get a little wear and tear on here. I don't know. I'm probably going to be downloading a, a lot of games on here anyways. So let's, uh, you know what, before we snap these on, let me make sure I get the, the, the right. Okay, so the plus goes with the plus. Yeah, they made that real easy. I don't know, I don't know how people were getting that jam. Maybe it was kids. If you was a grown-ass person getting this stuck, then I don't know what's going on. Oh, that's a little satisfying little clip. The click, ain't it? I feel weird taking these off. Ah, there you go. Look at that. Huh. You, I guess you push it back up. Nice, nice little snappy, snappy mechanic. Where's the other one at? Oh, hell, I just want to see how, how it snapped on there. So we got one. So you guys get the gist of it. Ooh, camera over here. Now, I'm a handheld person, man. I just, I, I love handhelds. <laughs> Nintendo pissed me off with those copy strike, that copy strike bullshit, but I, I can't lie, their, their handhelds are always, like, off the chain. Ooh, that click. That click, that click. 
Wow, this feels so good. Yeah, I, I just wish the controllers, uh, the joy cons with the little, like the, the tablet part feels great. Yeah, this thing, this thing feels sweet. Okay, so let's do some comparing to some of the other consoles. So here, obviously, it's one of the, the runner-ups. Well, back in the day, that's pretty much no competition now because Sony let their fucking handheld die. I will give Nintendo that. They don't let the handhelds die. I don't know if it's all going to fit on the screen. That goes to OG 3DS. Then this is this is the newest one right here. Well, I don't know. There's another 3DS, so this isn't the newest. I don't know, they got like... Four different fucking 3DSs. I don't know. <laughs> I just, I, I lose count. So, yeah, this, this is the size. See, now, when they come out with a Zelda version of this, oh, pff, it's going down. But the tablet part is damn near. I hate, I hate to put this on the screen. Well, soft cover. Damn, they're the same size that XL. <laughs> Just put some damn Joy Cons on there. Almost. Now, the Vita had a 5 inch screen, so. See, now. The... See, maybe that's what makes it feel weird. Like, if they had a D pad up here, I don't know. See, because the joysticks on here feel perfectly placed. And I don't know what it is. Maybe it's the, okay, maybe how curved it is on these edges right here. It makes it feel better to hold Do something. Yeah, I think that's what it is. It's kind of flat right here. I, I ordered some grips. Um, I got some other accessories I'll leave in the description. I'll probably have like a top five accessories, but I, I didn't even, um, yeah, this. Okay, yeah, the, the other one with the grips, I got to get. So it should be in the mail in a couple weeks. Clicky, clicky. That's some cool accessories. All right, let me. Um, where was the other thing I had? Oh, you know, I gotta put, I gotta put the controllers on, on here too. See how this feels. We'll do that. And then, where are oh over here? So I just want to show you guys the different size cartridges. Vita. Um, now, this is obviously a, a scan disc over here. I just want to show you guys the size of, you know, the different cartridges. And then this is 128 gig, the, the mini SD right here. Luckily, I had an extra one for the Switch because this one's not being used. I've, this one's in my phone. I upgraded to a 250 gig, and 128 gig should be fine for right now, a long time for um, the Switch if I fill that up. And this is a big 128 gig. Look at that. Little big, little big. <laughs> um, but yeah, the Nintendo. I don't know if you guys can hear that. It's got a like a loosey feel to it. I don't like that. And it it is thicker. I don't know if you guys could. You guys can see the PS Vita one. You know what? Better yet, let me do the. So here's the regular memory card, and here's the. Switch one. So yeah, it's thicker than you know your, your average um, card. But be careful, I scratch the screen because I will hack the fuck up and yell at myself. All right, so let's take these bad boys off. Okay, this is the release button right here. That's what that button was for. See how this feels. Uh, somebody open up new tech. That is just so fun. Okay, this was snapping on this one was the most satisfying. Yeah, that that was real nice. Oh, uh, I mean it's not awful. It's not as bad as how some of these other guys were making the scene. Like it was the end of the world. It's a little funky. It's not too. It's not too bad though. I mean, once you use a Steam controller, you could pretty much use anything. Steam controller was. Hot ass, so I would take this over to Steam Control. <laughs> Man, 
charger. It doesn't feel that bad. I'm, I may actually buy the charge, uh, the charge the version of this now. Oh, and in the casing. So let's talk about the casing real quick for uh, for games, and then we'll get to this taste test. Uh, okay. Where is? Oh, you know what? I forgot to compare a 3DS game. <clears throat> compare that real quick. So boom, three. That's funny. 3DS was the. To see, 3DS doesn't have that shake. See that? So yeah, I don't. Yeah, I, I don't know what that is. I don't like that. I'm probably gonna be downloading games anyways. I'm, I'm gonna start real soon. What the hell did I do? It's crazy. You have stuff set up and it's all gone, and then you know you look like an asshat. So yeah, okay, whatever. I'm not gonna deal with it. Um, but yeah, this case I want to show you that they're really taking up too much room, but. I'm not, I'm not even going to look for it. Oh, here it is, under this. Okay. The different uh, the different cases. So, I don't know. I just, it just seems like a lot of, you know, unnecessary space taken up. At least, you know, with this, you had, uh, you know, a manual, the game right there, and it's, it seemed like it was a, a, a pretty decent size for a portable. And then even the Vita, you want to go the, the long, like that, let me see. Yeah, it's about the same width. Yeah, exactly the same width, just a little taller. But even even the Vita, it just it just took up too much space. I feel like, and I know that's a fucking, it's a nitpick. I just I just want to compare. I, I just like, I like this case better. I wish they would have went uh, this route with it. Um, but you know, my new pick, but let's get to this, uh, taste test. Where is it? Okay. So we're going to taste this bad boy and, and we're going to see what this thing tastes like. It's the first time I didn't taste it. I just took it out so I could add this comparison. Let's see. That shit going to be nasty. Jesus Christ. That's one of the most bitterest things I ever had in my mouth. Ooh. Damn. I'm pretty sure ass don't even taste like that. Shit. Yeah, so that, that little motherfucker is nasty. Now, they put, like, I forgot what the name of the coating on here. But basically, for kids, they look like, oh, I'm trying to swallow. Basically, my son. So, shout out to Nintendo for that. If, I, if one of these got out or something, or he got a hold of it, he puts this in his mouth. I guarantee you. He'll, I wish he was here, because I'd put it in his mouth. Or just let him taste it to see his face reaction. Oh, but yeah, that that, yeah, that sits around in your mouth, man. That uh, that is a bitter taste. So yeah, that that was smart to make it a uh, kid proof. That's for sure. Um, yeah, guys. So check out some of the other accessories I got. I got like um a a, a rubber cover for this, and it goes over the controllers too. Um, a more screen protector that that's a better grade than the other one I had. And what was the other thing I got? Let me check real quick. Uh oh, dropping a lot of stuff. Uh, real quick, let me see. It's gonna be in a link anyway, so it doesn't even matter. Damn, it ain't coming to the third or seventh. Fuck. Oh, asking for my password and all that bullshit. Okay, so, okay, it was the grips. I got the grips. So that's what I ended up getting. I, I got the grips for it, where it's um, better to hold um, the tablet and then some screen glass. It's pretty cheap stuff. Uh, $8.90 $8 for that, $6.99 for the, the glass, and then $12.99 for the um, the rubber and flexible scratch-resistant case. So uh, pretty good deals. I'm leaving links to those. <clears throat> and... Uh, I'm about to play with this bad boy, turn on, um, try out some games, and we're going to have a full review of this, because I think there's an, enough games out there. I don't know if I'm going to get Switch, um, was it, 1-2 Switch, heard that was trash, I'm not going to get ARMS, um, what's another one, Splatoon, I don't know if I'm going to get that, but I got a couple of friends who have this, so it's going to be cool to play with them, and then 
take this to work and have fun with. I think it's going to be real dope to have at work. This may be one of the hottest handhelds. If they support it, like I think they're going to support it, this may be one of the hottest handhelds, period. Like, just support it like you did your 3DS. You can make four or five iterations, whatever. Just keep making this, this fucking Switch awesome, man. I think it's going to be there. But uh, you guys have a blessed day in one mouth thing. Gaming. But like.